Hello there, and welcome to a very special edition of the Cargo Bay Rips, honoring E-Dub ripping stuff. Uh, we've got something very special. Uh, I am Brady C. here with my co-host as always. Adam B, you ain't lying, BC. This is a very special episode of the Cargo Bay. Um, yeah. We're going to be ripping some vintage 1977 Star Wars on the show for the first time, minus one pack of Series 3, which we live streamed on, on Twitch perhaps long, long ago. God, that was a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah um, it was. Um, so, yeah, basically, never really opened these. Um, so, uh, Edub Rip and Stuff, for those of you who are unaware, go to their channel immediately and smash their like and subscribe button as he is always bringing fantastic Star Wars content. And uh, make sure you go through the catalog because those videos are. It just, I like to unwind watching some vintage Star Wars being open. You know, have a nice glass of wine, see some vintage Star Wars packs open. Uh, you can't have a better evening. Or more recently, BC, he's been ripping a little bit of Chrome. I've been enjoying that, too. In fact, I just absolutely. today, I watched a very special yeah. hit out of, a, yeah. out of a Galaxy 2022 box. So Yeah. Yeah, do check that uh, out. So it is, uh, and it hasn't happened yet. It, it may by the time this is released, but that 2021 Chrome Galaxy, I just see it. I just see it waiting. I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready for the goodness that's in that box. If it's so, out already, um, I'll drop a link to that um, in the description of this video. If it's out by the time we we get this yeah. posted, but uh, BC, I've got the camera set up for you first, but right. I can't change uh, it uh, if you really want to go second. I, I'll, I'll do it here. Give me just a moment. Let me go to my fancy, fancy. Ba boom. All it's right. Looking pretty fancy, BC. Looking fancy, isn't it? So I've got I've got my sleeveys over here because we're we're gonna be taking some some TLC. That's right. On each of these, so these were from E Dub's Rip and Stuff, opening a box of series five. This is the orange board. This is the last series from the seventy seven set. Uh, and when we did our set guide review. We found that we loved pretty much everything about this. There's a lot of kind of oddities and behind the scenes stuff in this. So uh, I was very generous of him to, to pull those top four packs and send them our way. Uh, you know, maybe we'll enjoy some of this gum too. What, what could possibly go wrong? Hey, I you know? might give it a try. And <laughs> speaking of packs, what a, a beautiful pack. Definitely my favorite pack design just because I'm an X Wing fanatic. Yeah. These are amazing. I, and I, just the opening of of the old school wax packs just it makes me feel so happy so here, here we go we're getting into it i'm ex I'm, I'm i'm nervous and excited yeah. <laughs> if see. i ever drop and ruin cards this would be yeah, this would be this the is, time this is gonna be the one so here we'll we'll go in as carefully as we can and uh, uh we'll go back and make sure that um, Edub pulled everything he was looking for out of the rest of that box. I think he got decent copies to submit of all of the missing cards, but if we somehow wind up with one of those that he needs, uh, and it looks like it could potentially grade that high, well... So, here's what time does, you know? Time uh -huh. is gonna fuse some gum <laughs> on top of all... This is George. Yep. <laughs> uh, this is the George sticker. Uh, I'm I'm not gonna offend anybody by trying to rip this off right now, so we'll take this heavy son of a gun and set it over there. Oh, uh, there it is, Flight uh, of the Falcon. Absolutely That's beautiful, amazing card. Flight of the Falcon, the name of a Game Boy Advance video game, many years later. Yeah. And uh, we'll we'll do the the E Dub. We'll we'll you know we'll kind of let's. You got you got decent corners. That's decent. well centered. That's not that's not too shabby. So you know, let's very carefully put it in. Got a, a bubble in that blue logo a little bit, or is that just dust on there? In that? Uh, oh, it's a, just a spot. A, it's a yeah. There's a there's sort of a print spot in the, there. That but, that won't kill a grade by itself. Yeah. Um, but yeah, beautiful. Love this card. Love again the behind the scenes special effects. The wizards there. Here we've got a cool awaiting the imperial attack. 
What a hallway. In the top 10 hallways of all time, BC. Absolutely glorious hallway. We get, we get, here we go. Take a look at that corner up there. We got a little tip on the corner, you know. It's uh, it's not a 10, but again, oh, come on with this. <laughs> all right, now I, I don't even care that I got a solid yellow line on this. I just love this Alec, Sir Alec Guinness and George Lucas. You can just see how much fun Alec Guinness has had set there that day, can't you? <laughs> Can you just tell he's having I, just the best time of his life? Hey, I think that yellow stripe's a bonus as far as I'm concerned. You know, I like yellow. <laughs> That's the depth of my character. I like a color. It is. <laughs> yeah. It's a nice a nice highlight on the side there. It's been uh, kind of on the, on the edge of the, the, the sheet. Here's a cool one. Man. And it, the Luke with the orange suit on the orange border looks amazing. Sealed in the pack since 70, I guess technically 78, but just yeah, waiting since... on you to rip this pack, BC. Yeah, looks looks pretty good. These are very cool. Very, very cool. Let's keep on going. We got, we got a few more here to treasure. We got the Stormtroopers Assemble. Love it. Card 292. Back when films had extras. That's right. <laughs> Those were real dudes in there. <laughs> um, let's, uh, let's see. Oh, Whoa. man. That's a great card. Inside the sand crawler. That's nice. And, oh, hey, how come about on. that, VC? You're always pulling the cool solos. No nonsense, privateer Han Solo. Awesome, awesome card <laughs> great, name. Great card name. No nonsense, privateer Han Solo. Uh, uh, so first pack, I just got to say, uh, um, I'm elated. I'm thrilled. I'm on cloud nine. Uh, it, this is uh, this is super super cool. So let's let's go into to pack. Number two here. When we're done opening these packs, I want to read all that copy on the back of that card yeah. pack there. Let's do that. All right, yeah, we got we got we got some good good clean pack opening. Oh, look at the the fun we had on this one. <laughs> Holy smokes! Uh, that that looks like you got extra gum there. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Love this. Wouldn't this it be, been that... cool to hang out on that day, BC? Man, I'm telling you. Filming explosions on the Death Star. BC, I'm having a pooch interruption. Pooch interruption? I get it. It's an exciting time. I'd want to <laughs> drop in too. Yeah, on a handmade model that you get to blow up later that day, you know? That's super cool. Look at those bell bottoms. <laughs> oh, man. And then we've got a friendly chat among alien friends. <laughs> they're just hang they're having a good time. They're just hanging out at the bar, you know, decompressing. Hey! Oh. This is all your fault, R2. <laughs> That's a great card name. Ooh, we 3PO on the a... wires. So that's a that's a chonker back there. Yeah, look at look at the cut on <laughs> on this thing. Droids on the run. <laughs> look at that. Hey, wow. that's a, that's an error card, BC charge extra. Yeah, yeah that's 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 an error of some kind. It's a cool card. We've got makeup. For the <laughs> Bantha. Again, fun, just great behind the scenes stuff. Oh, let's see. Flight of the Falcon. I got another one. Nice. I got another one. Is it in better or worse shape than your last one, BC? I'd say it's they're both actually pretty well centered. And the corners all look actually pretty decent. Oh. The, the true spirit of, of E dub. Ripping stuff, you know. I like to eyeball these and and maybe consider sending one to PSA for fun, you know. 
That would be nice. I would like to... Someday we're going to submit some cards to PSA. When I am Absolutely. employed, I will be s submitting some cards for yeah. grading one of these days. And here's the last card. So this is going to be the last from my, my two packs. Ugh. What a way to end it, BC. How can you top that? You got, you got George Lucas directs his counterpart, Luke, quotation marks. Uh, again, I think, I think we noted that there might be some uh, <laughs> a little, little brushback on the director and uh, an actor being known as counterparts, but we'll go with it, you know. Yeah. But what a what a great card to end on from my from my my packs there. So yeah, very very cool. We got I've got a lot of uh, shrapnel <laughs> from the exploded <laughs> gum back here, so I might might clean up clean up the cards a little bit, but gum amazing. Dust. The uh, the flight of the falcon uh, really is a highlight. I'm, I'm I'm actually very glad I have two of them. I think one of those probably would be one I would I would consider sending to to PSA yeah. because I can, you know. <laughs> yeah, I would like to I, I would like to find at least one card in my stack to slab just to commemorate the occasion. Yeah, yeah totally. Uh, Let me go back to my my other camera. Well, BC. Uh, I gotta say, you're you're in for a freaking treat. Uh, it's fantastic. Uh, I I love these cards. Uh, all the vintage stuff. The set guides really did make me gain a new appreciation for it. But in hand, phenomenal. I I'm I have developed itchy fingers watching that. Um, so let me let me do some finagling here. There may be an edit point and post. I'll freeze my face for it. Thank you. Thank you, BC. <laughs> that helps. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right, I'm back. I'm going in. All right. Oh, BC, next video. I'm, I'm going to have me a haircut. What do you think about that? I think I think next video, I'm going to have me a haircut, too. It's been a long time. <laughs> I'm going I'm going to be very haircutted. Are you are you going down to the down to the the studs? I'm going. Please give me a job, Mister Boss Man Short. I'm going. Uh, I I really hope you don't think I'm a drug addled just because I got long hair. Man, man, these are purdy. They're so cool. All right, here's here's pack number one. I can tell there has been. A gum explosion. <laughs> Cracking that wax. Oh yeah, we got we got yeah. gum dust. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Glory it. It. It's like it's like unearthing an ancient relic, you know? Uh I think this this will not be the gum that I try because that is that that is a fly. Oh, amazing. Let's see. No, I guess that's just cardboard. Um, cardboard residue of some kind? If I, but I do have a double sticker pack here, oh. BC. How about that? One of the beautiful features of that box that Edubs has was, was several untainted stickers. Oh, man. Oh, that is no. beautiful. C-3PO does have a doesn't have some damage to his oh, head. No, no. <laughs> I, I noticed this pack did have two uh, two fang marks uh, that I think we may see appear on some of these cards here. Yeah, there's a little bit of surface damage to Luke the Star Warrior, but nothing nothing too bad. Oh, oh X-wing's position for the cameras, and is that George standing over there? I think that might just yep, be. That's definitely George checking out those X Wings. When he was like, "Are you guys getting me my freaking shots or what?" <laughs> you got, oh, come on, so rad. Come on with that. Look at that. Look at how sharp. The, there's some. This this fang mark is gonna go through the pack. There's an an uh, indent there. But look at how crystal clear that logo is. That's something I love that's... when the the printing on the logo is really sharp. Nice. Appreciate that. There's filming the Death Star. I want to take a look at this R. R. Nice. There's our friendly hey. chat among friends. Hey, 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 I love hey, this hey. this strand of Christmas ornaments yeah. over here. <laughs> There's all your fault, R two. 
Yeah. And the final uh, one of this pack is Droids on the Run, and I think we've passed through to the safe zone here. So the front of that card is is safe, but we do have... We got the gum oh, damage the gum, on the back. The gum dust. Now, I'm hoping this next pack, BC, I'm hoping that it... Um, the gum is intact enough for me to give a little chomp. Okay, well... Sure. If it's, if it's been... I have I have chewed older gum. Yeah. So I can tell you from experience that it turns to dust. And uh -huh. it does make you feel alive because you realize that you may be uh shortening your lifespan. <laughs> I might be doing irreparable harm to my body. Hey, here we got a movie fact card in the back here. That's exciting. Oh, yeah. Um I don't want to hurt this pack because I want to display this pack. Squeak. All right. Okay. Hey, there's Chewy, and that gum looks nice. Oh, it looks delicious. <laughs> That's a nice, beautiful piece. <laughs> there's oh. the whole crew right there, BC. The model team. Proudly nice. showing off their work. Sorry, I'm doing this for me more than I've been doing it for the camera. That is an issue. Various droids collected by the Jawas. <laughs> Again, this is one of my favorite cards in the set. Oh, look at that! That's amazing. Nice little peek into the Falcon there. <sighs> you can see the color shift on the orange here. We're gonna go to a slightly lighter orange border that may not show up on camera. Yeah, corridors of the Death Ooh. Star. There's a nice, nice Vader. Vader. Yeah, pretty good printing on that there, Vader. Shooting in Tunisia. <laughs> Which I don't know if they're talking about the shot or the jaw was shooting R2. Yeah. yeah. Whoa, that's a pretty card. That's a great Forgot card about this image. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. And then my final card, BC. 3PO and R2. Nice. And that is that does have this nice movie facts. Let's, I want to check the back of some of these. You can see where this one this one's got some of that that blur of of the the printing going slightly askew let's let's check out the card backs here we get any more movie facts yeah a couple I've of got, these i've got a few movie facts on mine greta was designed in england by stuart freeborn chewy the wookie trademark was played by british actor peter mayhew we all know that obviously Millennium falcon took a lot of work to become airborne in star wars it was mounted on a series of controls which operated ship movements and lights. It was photographed by the highly mobile Dijkstraflex. Dijkstra getting his name on the equipment. Yeah, smart, he smart was. thing. Here's Let's Ralph McQuarrie mentioned. Uh, developed all of the American Chuck Cantina creatures. Uh, him and Rick Baker. And then I have the daughter of Debbie Re Reynolds and Eddie Fisher. Carrie Fisher was born October 21st, 1956. Her, perform for, per, perform, her performance her performance, her in Star Wars is Carrie's performer. first starring ro role, though her film debut was a smaller part in Shampoo. Making Star Wars was a lot of fun, says Carrie. It turned out to be kind of adult recess. <laughs> well, it, I, it, there's a lot like you can say about Star Wars. <laughs> I like that shampoo is referenced on the back of a Star Wars Yeah, card. I love it. I, Alien gets <laughs> referenced on a card, which is very cool. And um, shampoo. And now, BC, you can see the rookie warring. I am not... Uh, I am not going to chew this as much as I chewed that gum from the black hole or something. Can't remember mm -hmm. what it was. So uh, if you really want to yeah. see me uh, torture myself, that's there's other videos for that. But in honor of E-Dubs' very kind gift, I am going to, and just out of my own curiosity, I'm going to give a little taste uh, to this 1978 stick of gum here. The Chewbacca sticker is in pretty good condition under that gum, honestly. Yeah. Not bad. I've got, I'm, I'm just, I'm ripping the Band-Aid off with my gum on, my gum fragments on mine. So I, I do have two George stickers. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Very good. Here's a um, little chomp. Just going to give that right into the mic. Oh, it's soft. That's concerning. <laughs> I'm not sure that's good. Good news. 
Mmm, soft. You That's know, nice. That That's great. That um is a much more pleasant experience and Yeah, I'll be back. <laughs> So while uh, Adam B vomits and brushes his teeth for a little while, uh, I'll hold down the fort and just kind of talk about uh, talk about the experience here. I gotta say, I loved it. Uh, big fan of the vintage. Again, go check out our uh, our set guide videos. We we did complete the entire original trilogy. So that's seventy seven series one through five. Empire Strikes Back series one through three. Return of the Jedi series one and two, and we're we're into our oddities series now as well. Uh, but I I will say doing those set guides did, and uh, our research, which was uh, a lot of E Dub ripping stuff, opening just glorious boxes, uh, really gained an appreciation uh, for the the vintage sets, uh, including maybe some of the more overlooked ones. The series five in particular has just some super cool behind the scenes stuff uh my my personal fave probably is is flight of the falcon welcome back <laughs> i was just jabbering you can cut it out if you want to but no, uh, i thought it was all very it. charismatic uh, i'm sure it was so how, how was the gum that so much better than my last experience with ancient gum <laughs> like truly you there was still sugar to be tasted in it it's oh. still uh still malleable um it did eventually powderize a little bit but that whatever that last stick of 30 plus year old gum was that i ate it it immediately turned into a toxic powder in my yeah. mouth so it tastes like paper and oh, it tasted yeah like cardboard and and something yeah. that will cause me health problems in the future this just tastes yeah. like gum so <laughs> well at least the flavors there yeah Wow. Well, how about that, VC? That was I, uh, pretty I'm, exciting. I'm, I'm on cloud nine. I, I'm I'm excited to, to you know to look at these under the old the old lens, you know, go over the corner. But I think one of these flight of the falcons has has got a, a PSA. I'm gonna have to submission. I'm gonna have to go back it. through my stack to find the card I most I most want to send in here, BC. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to, to look over it with a fine tooth comb. While we're talking vintage, I do want to shout out a little gift that you sent me, BC. Oh, is that right? Which is this yeah. Topps Yamakatsu uh, X Wing in the hangar here. Oh, what an incredible. There it is. There it is in focus. Just look at the stripe on that X Wing. Look at the color. Look at the, the pilot, who I don't believe is Luke. It may be Biggs or Wedge, standing there hand on hip in that incredible set and then of course the backs of these are are fantastic so having this in person uh you know shout out to our our obscure star wars cards video yeah. check that out if you're interested in cards of the era yeah i, I saw that and it, it had adam b written all over it it's a beautiful image uh the the star wars logo in yeah. the corner is like an an elegant chef's kiss for me. Yeah, beautiful. And uh, I mean, how are you going to go wrong with putting a Millennium Falcon on the back of your card there? You're not. You're not going to go wrong. So official Tops Tops product, just Tops in Japan. Um, so yeah, check out that video. We got another one coming out soon. I'm not sure what oh order we're dishing all this stuff oh, out in, but we've been oh, we did a oh, lot of oh. openings. Oh. Ooh, we'll do a hobby boy, talk boy. soon, but no hobby talk this past week, I suppose. Yeah, we'll get around to it. Yeah. All right. Well, I guess that's it, BC. Hey, thanks for checking it out. Make sure you like and subscribe. We'll be back with some more hobby talk. But more importantly, make sure you go like and subscribe, eat up, rip and stuff. And, that's right. And go check out opening a full box of Series 5 or or even Series 1 if you're feeling wild for, for a good time. Check out um, the PSA returns, too, because uh, I, I find that to be highly educational. Um, incredibly valuable information. Great resource for anyone who's interested in vintage, vintage or, or wanting to know more about it. Um, really good stuff. And, and check out the, the Galaxy Rips, too. Yeah. 
Yeah, thanks. Thank thank you again, E Dub and uh BZ. I got my my finger on the, the airlock over here whenever you're ready. For a second I was looking at the screen and I was like, what happened to the border? I was just, <laughs> oh, looking, no. at, I was just looking at the Discord window. <laughs>